turn over to First Thessalonians um, chapter three. First Thessalonians. Well, actually, yeah, go there, but also hold, uh, go to uh, Hebrews chapter ten. The Bible says in Hebrews chapter ten, verse twenty-two. Let us draw near with the true heart, in full assurance of faith, having our hearts sprinkled from an evil conscience, and our bodies washed with pure water. Let us hold fast the profession of our faith without wavering, for he is faithful that promised. And we see a, a very similar phrase, right? Stand fast, hold fast. He said, hold fast the profession of our faith without wavering. Another phrase that we see in Romans chapter 10, the Bible tells us, you know, that we are to confess with our mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in our heart that God hath raised him from the dead and thou shalt be saved. The Bible says we are to stand fast or hold fast to the profession of our faith without wavering. When I remember when I was nine years old, it was as clear as day to me. I remember here in the Romans road, I understood it. I can, I can hear the words in my father's lips. I can see the picture, the, the, a picture in my mind of the words on the page. I remember Romans 3.23, Romans 6.23, John 3.16, uh, Acts 16.31. I remember those verses. I re, there, there was a few more I know, but I remember those verses clearly. And I remember thinking, I get it. I understand. I and I prayed, and I got it. I believed it, and I stand fast in that profession, and I want it to be as clear as, as day for my kids. I want it to be as clear as day for you. I want it to be as clear as day for the city of Jacksonville and the United States on soul-winning Mega Marathon Day. I want it crystal clear. We need to hold fast to the profession of our faith. Bible says our bodies washed with pure water. We want it crystal.